So how does Smithville's uh, schedule maybe prepare you for a challenge like tonight where maybe some people uh, wouldn't expect a, a big victory out of you, but I'm sure uh, maybe it's it's helped to build your confidence. Yeah, I mean, we got a super tough schedule all year. You know, a lot of times the coaches say that a lot of the tournaments that we wrestle in the middle of the year are going to be tougher than districts and state. And I think that really getting uh, doing well in those tournaments, getting more confidence boost, going to state, and then like you feel like you uh, mostly peaked towards the end of the season as well, and maybe this is just kind of a continuation of that, that, that you've kind of been at your best yeah. uh, here these last few weeks? Yeah, I'd say yeah, I, I definitely peaked at the end of the season. You know, it's my last year. I wanted to go get, not wrestling in college next year. wanted to go prove what I have this last year. And you know, just put everything I had on that. I'd stay in here. So. Yeah, so this kind of being your last match then uh, and, and going into a situation where you guys are behind, you, you need to find a way to score some of these tight wins. Uh, you know, what were your expectations? I mean, was it just undoubtedly find a way to win regardless of score? Well, I mean, I just went out there with the mindset I'm going to wrestle my match. I'm going to control, control the ties, take control on top whenever I get a takedown, just grind them out the whole six minutes. How important was it to ride him out the finish of the second period after that reversal to, to kind of take that four to one lead? I, I've got a feeling that, that that left you pretty confident regardless of yeah. what he chose in the third. That definitely puts you in a better spot moving into the third period, you know, but I just wanted to keep scoring points as much as I could, build that lead. Yeah, and that you weren't, you didn't kind of sit on it in the third. Was that part of your mindset was, okay, he, he's going neutral. He's looking, you know, to, to find a way to rack up some takedowns. Let's see if I can stick with my offense. Was that your approach? Yeah. Exactly, actually. I wanted to keep control of the ties, keep control of the match, not let him get any offense. That's where my mindset was going in the third period and score more points, score more points.